Are, are, are we winning? Oh, are we winning? there he is. Are, are we winning? Are you winning, are, son? Are we winning or are we losing? How's the fucking I don't know. We've been talking to Illy Yugas. We completely lost our train. We of lost 14 yeah. seats so far. Yeah, uh, Jim comes back. We know what kind of women he likes now. <laughs> hey, now. Hey, <laughs> speaking of women, what is the quartering up to? Oh, are you are you seeing the tantrum that he's throwing on? Yeah, I've been, I, do, yeah I, I've been watching. What the fuck is he doing? Uh, I can tell you exactly what it is. So um, when Matt did his little charity stream thing, I, I called them out and said it was transparent bandwagon. Uh, you know, they, they were trying to get on a trend. They saw what happened to Ralph. They wanted press to use it to try to fluff up their numbers and shit. And um, I, I called out quartering. I was like, I don't want to take away from Matt's, uh, uh, you know, a charity stream. I don't want to pull a quarter pounder. And I think that's what pissed them off. Yeah, and by the way, I actually messaged him because, you know, he was talking shit on Twitter. And I was like, look, you know, we still have our stream going. Jim was here earlier, you know, if you want to pop I, in. I mean, look how transparent these fuckers are. He, he's like, uh, you know, he, he keeps going on and on and on. He's like, uh, he, he's trying to challenge me to do a stream. And then he's like, yeah, do a stream so I can uh, super chat you shit to get you deplatformed. Yeah, so the thing he said is I want him to do it on his platform. And I was like, well, look, we, you know, he's already been on here tonight. He's not even doing his own stream. And then, and then Little V and Short Fed Otaku run in. No, it's a joke. It's a joke, mate. I'm supposed to listen to that when these faggots hang around with people like Matt, who do, you know, has flagged people and crowd who doxes people and goes after people. Like, I'm just, they're so fucking transparent. And then, uh, well, the Sargonites have been really loud like the last week. They've been really aggressive. No shit. Yeah. Yeah. It's, they're they're happy. Ralph has been taken care of. They're very and, happy. And he, uh, Andy's on the horizon, and you know they've they've got their little fucking targets. Yep. B by the way, I'm... can I can I just give Andy a lot of credit because he's still on YouTube. He hasn't been banned, and he's been you know pretty much riding with us. And uh, you got really... you got the majority of the heat because it was a charity stream. I mean that's the that's what it is. That's yeah. that's true. Like like I've looked back, and I, of course I've thought about it. Uh, if we hadn't done that charity stream, we'd probably still be on YouTube. Like let's just be honest. About but uh, imagine uh, yeah. that that YouTube is so fucked <laughs> that raising twenty six thousand dollars for cancer kids is a bad thing. That's what shot you in the foot. No, 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 that actually is what it is. That like that's completely what it is. Anyway, go ahead, Jim. You're gonna say something. Yeah, no, I was gonna say this. Um. You know, he he's the one that wanted to have a chat with me. I was waiting for the invite, but he's like, no, I've got to do it on my channel. Well, I'm here now, quartering. I just sent him the link. So Quarter pounder, tubby tits. Come on, boy, boy. Let's let's have a conversation. But look, he's been it. on here with you before. And, you know, we thought it was going to be some type of. No, no, Ralph, know. we need to hear the genius idea the quartering came up with two months ago. Gamergate 2 is going to save the West. OK, we need <laughs> to get these fucking feminists out of video games. And that's going to secure the white race, I think. I think that's what they're but going to do. But it was just, it's just so funny because we had him on here and I thought you guys are going to go at it. And he, it was very respectful conversation. There was really no. It won't be respectful this time. All right. Well, you know, he has the link if he wants to if he wants to hop on. So. He um, called you a kid. That made me laugh. I, oh, the, yeah, it reminded me of the, like the you know those faggots on Tumblr. They're like, oh, sweet summer child. Like that's the kind of that's how it came off to me. Or like and the cold steel, the hedgehog thing. Where he's like nothing personnel, kid. Listen, listen up, kiddo. All, all right, there, uh, FNGR. All right, <laughs> calm down, pony kid. Let's not get into this. <laughs> <laughs> and it's not I'm, on I'm YouTube. Sorry, I'm throwing so. your election stream off. No, but, I don't you know, care. I wanted we to stop. Give, uh, this fat retarded. You know, <laughs> I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it for save the. It. We we stopped. Look, we, we're still monitoring the elections, and you know, but. Yeah, we're down 15. This is seats. more fun. Yeah. Yeah. This real. is more fun. Actually, actually, I said that to him. I was like, look, we are the elections are pretty much over. You know, if you want to come on and talk to Jim, he was on here earlier. I'm pretty sure, you know, he's down to, you know, do it now. So just I I don't know. I mean, quartering's the one that's like, let's have a chat, kiddo. And I said, Okay, you know, let me finish my dinner and stuff. And then I come back and he's like, No, it has to be on your channel. Yeah, that's what he said. He said, nope, it's Jim's so channel I'm doing, or I'm fuck doing that a pussy. Stream on Sunday. So I, I don't know what the, the fucking issue is. Like, it's any angle, any talking point they can try to latch onto. It's like they're trying to goad you into doing something so they can seize the opportunity to teach you a lesson. I, these fucking people are so retarded. That's what I think. That's exactly what I think it is, is they're riding high after Ralph getting suspended from YouTube. So they're thinking, oh, we can bait Jim into doing a stream, and then we'll just yeah. go and mass flag Jim's stream. And because YouTube's on high alert now, we could get it taken that's exactly down. What it is. Yeah. Look at him backing out. Nope, I'll chat with Jim on his channel or not at all. Or is he afraid? I'm not the one that put the invite out there. 
But you didn't even a, have a stream going. What kind going? of a bitch like, goes and challenges somebody to have a discussion yeah. with them and oh. then demands that they are the one that hosted? Like, he was they talking all this shit. shit dude. They, they always pull that, oh, I'll talk to you. Okay. But it has to be this, this, and this. Fuck off. Fucking loser. Well, like, if you had a show going or you had something, you know, already planned, that would be one thing. But like, well, it's so weird. Like, I, I, they're talking points. I always see the same shit come up. It's like, he's like, oh, it's Jim getting DDoSed again. Yeah, I got DDoSed on a night. I had to go to another location to finish that fucking stream. And then I had to wait to get a second ISP, another fucking service provider. So I've got two now. I've got cable internet and I've got fucking uh, the phone shit, DSL or whatever the fuck it is. So one's a static IP and the other's not. So I can, I can fucking stream. And then I went and streamed directly after that. And he's like, oh, I guess he's implying that that wasn't real. And then he doesn't get why I'm making fun of Monday and Matt or why I'm taking shots at them with, you know, his snotty little attitude that you were doing a charity stream. And he's like, fuck the kids. I want the money. I, I just, I so there's just, I can't stand these people. Am I the only one? Like, is, the, is this not reached the point where they're just so fucking obnoxious? I can't take it anymore. What I think the funniest thing is that, that they were crowing about the Wall Street Journal piece. Every piece of evidence that any of us has been able to gather they had nothing to do with it. It was this guy that works for Storify, which is an Antifa run uh, website. This Michael E. Hayden guy. He's the guy that, that made it happen. That's true. But is this a real, did somebody actually vote for me? Is that true? Where, where's this from? It's from the lounge. <laughs> you're, on your, you're on your way, buddy. <laughs> Ethan Ralph has one vote. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Uh, Ethan Ralph of has more votes in, in an election than Sargon. Sargon <laughs> beat the FO. Do you have a suit, Ralph? Uh, I do have one. I'm not sure if it still fits. It's been a while since I put it on. But Why did uh, this guy try to backpedal? Wow. Can felons get elected? For In yeah, some states, yeah. In some um, states, yes, but they can't vote in most states. That's funny. You know, you ask the question, what did, can what felons did, uh, get elected? They get elected every day. That's true. Uh, he says he says he'll be available on Sunday. That's what he said. Oh, Mr. fucking. Why do you like, why do they open their fucking mouths and challenge people and act like some fucking tough or whatever? Because he forgot that Jim does a stream on Sunday. And now he's like, oh, wait, Jim has a but stream why, on Sunday. Like, okay, <sighs> I'll wait till Sunday to try to pull my master plan to get Jim suspended. He's sitting on his ass right now. Well, at quartering, you can sit in the audience and watch the fucking stream like everybody else. I'm not bringing your soy-filled fat ass onto my stream and subjecting my poor audience to listening to you drone on about retarded shit. <laughs> oh my god, board games, you guys, comic books, fuck off. We're going to be talking about funny shit. We're going to have a little bit of fun making fun of people. Now, if you want to have a debate, you can show up here, or you can host it on your channel like you initially did with your uh, offer to invite Jim on for a chat. But you're not, you're not smart, quartering. Like your 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 attempts here are pretty fucking transparent. Actually, hosting it on his own channel would be amazing. I don't know. I mean, obviously, I think it'd be entertaining if he came on here, especially right now. Like this victim narrative shit with these fucking people. Like it's yeah. oh, Anita's so terrible, and they all have GoFundMe's for their littlest fucking problems. And then he's whining. He's like, oh my, Jim's audience made fun of my wife. He posted a picture of my wife. Okay, Zoe, calm down. I'm sorry if they made fun of somebody you know. All right, so we'll we'll see. Uh, it look it looks like he's. Uh, I was just like, well, it'd be it'd be fun if you did it right now, but if if you don't want to, it's, it's up to you. Of course he doesn't. He's a fucking gutless little bitch. I mean, it's if hard, he did want to talk to you though, it would be, it would be easy. You would just join his stream. So if he if he like he's full of shit if he thinks. I, he's I'm backing now. Well, quartering. If you want to have eighteen skeptics on your stream with you because you need emotional support, go ahead. <laughs> You can bring on you can bring on the little gypsy that LARPs is a doctor. You can bring on Shirt Fed Otaku and he can pretend to be an autistic mute disabled mm. lesbian to get nudes off women in Gamergate again. We can do it all. Like you bring them all on. I don't care. <laughs> Jim's about to have more wins than Donga <laughs> in one match. <laughs> well, we'll see. I mean, he has the he has the link. He has the opportunity. I mean, I, I don't Is it time yet to play Quartering's theme song? Does yeah, he... but you have, you have pigs oinking noises queued up and ready. To... <laughs> uh, what is this? Something thing, like so? that. Something like that. Audience wants me to say wheat fields. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I, I know what you're going to play, Gator. Do it. Play it. 
<laughs> a little chicken, huh? Quartering your bitch made. Oh wait, I'll, I'll make a poll. Is quartering chicken? Uh, but I, wait, I think, like, is, he, is he literally handicapped? He understands I'm doing a stream on Sunday, right? He's like, Jim's too afraid to stream on his channel. I have an art contest with V and Sargon that's scheduled for Sunday fun day. Like, he knows that's happening, right? Is he under the assumption that I've, I've stopped streaming? Like, I don't even, I don't even hate the guy, but I mean, and you know, he's done, he's done a couple of good things I like, but. Like, <laughs> name him. Well, okay. I'll name one that he, he did make a video when Buzzfeed put out a bullshit hit piece on me. But, like, we have the stream going on now. Like, what makes him think that, oh, you should just start up a special stream just to, like, talk to him? I, that makes no sense, really. Uh, Am I drunk? I'm just a peasant, though. I mean, he's like, he, he you know, I, I actually, let me let me be humble here. You know, let me, uh, <laughs> let me put myself in the right frame of mind. I'm talking to a better person. Quartering, you said you have a bigger audience and a bigger pool than me now. And that's totally true, bro. I need that audience. You need to bring me on your channel and give me some of that exposure. Well, yeah, I need you to take me under offer. your wing. Like it's not. It's not that. It's just. Oh, just the kill stream. I mean, you said flat out. If he, if he wants to start up on his own channel, you'll go there. So, like, what, if, if you want problem? truly neutral ground, yeah, I'm sure Josh will do it. I mean, there's oh, any, yeah. I any no will do I'll it. do it too yeah. on stream.me. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine it's the thing is he's crying on twitter he's also saying that he's laughing about us being here and uh well that's fine. not coming on here but quartering your your streams do what 300 people at best like what are you fucking talking about uh that it's 400 Oh my bad. I'm sorry. My are we talking about about are we talking about viewers or pounds? I've got lost. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Both. But like this fucking guy, like, he always does this every fucking time. He fucking talks shit on Twitter, talks shit behind your back, talks shit on his streams, and then chickens out. And as soon as he, I bet you, if he came on to that right now, he'd fucking kiss everyone's ass. That's what he fucking does. Ring. Always, yes, always, did. every fucking time. To me, he did the same shit. He talks shit on Twitter. No, wait, Unfo I thought he was a friend of yours. No, look, so he unfollows me, right? So I'm like, yo, what did the fuck? He? Are, are you mad at me? So he hops on and goes, oh, it was a glitch. Sorry about that or whatever, right? And we talked for a bit. And then he told me, <laughs> did, did you, I'm sorry, did you see what Keemstar tweeted at him? No, no. no, no what no, did no. he say? Uh, go ahead, this is the most recent. I'm sorry, Andy, I'm sorry. Right, <laughs> go ahead, Andy. Go ahead, Andy. Oh, wait, sorry. Uh. I have my submitted. Well, go ahead, Andy. Finish your thought. I'll go ahead and pull up Source. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, it's fast. It's the fast. quartering. Sorry, just real quick. He said, like just now, tell Jim to fire up his stream or set the fuck down. I don't know why he wouldn't just join us. Well, one of his things he said to me was, uh, you could dual stream it. I don't know. Look, we have the stream going now. I mean, it'll be clipped and posted on YouTube regardless. Like, I really don't. I don't know. But he just said that why won't Jim boot up his own channel? And the quartering says he's afraid of his sweetie squad. Why? <laughs> what sense does that make? Why is Jim afraid of his own audience? I, I don't know what the fuck he's going on about. I, I've i streamed on my channel. I streamed after the DDoS once I got my fucking ISP worked out. I'm streaming this fucking upcoming weekend on Sunday, just like I normally do. He's mad because I made fun of them, and I called out attention to what Matt was doing, which was having, you know, he's got a stream going. He's got Crowd as a moderator. He's got Sargon as a guest. Then V shows up. It's the skeptic version of what Ralph did. They wanted to ride the publicity wave to be the badass rebels, you know, doing the activism shit. That's what they wanted. The fucking platform Gamergate 2 as their big hashtag. So Trump would tweet about it. Well, let me look. Uh, let me look back. Um, let's see. Um, is that anybody in that picture, by the way? Is that somebody that, that I should wife. know? Is it? What? Yeah. <laughs> no, wait. Is that actually... Yeah, that's his wife. You're serious? That's Quartering's wife? What? <laughs> oh, no. <wow. laughs> yeah, her name is, her name is Clarence. <laughs> her? Um, hey, yeah, I've ahead. seen weirder shit, okay? <laughs> that wouldn't really surprise me that much. Um, I, I, I mean, I don't want to read all of his DMs, but basically he's saying you're, you're afraid or something. I don't know. Oh, yeah. my God. 
I'm super oh. terrified of you quartering. He's I mean, afraid. You're afraid. why would he be Fucking afraid? Lynch. So look, all it would take, and look, I hate to be so meta, but let's just be honest. You know, all it would take is Jim to fire up his stream. There'd be ten thousand or twenty thousand people watching. And make you know, you know, all kinds of fucking thousands of dollars off it of it. It makes like a yeah, thousand dollars. Yeah, like so, like, like there's what, no reason for him not yeah, to. Yeah, if he really, if he really wants to, like, there's no, there's no reason to be afraid. Like, so his offer was come on here, which would basically make us money, or to go on hit, uh, go on courting's own channel, which would make him money. So what is the what? What do you mean he's afraid? Like I, I don't know. It doesn't really make any. It God, make it's almost sense. it almost seems like they they want to try to create a situation to flag me. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. God, I mean, know. Like that, they, they think you won't stream. That uh, he knows that you won't start up a stream right now. Yeah. So he's like, that's the only way that he'll get out of it because he knows he won't do it. And then he can call you a pussy for not doing the thing that you weren't going to do anyway, even though we're live now. Fucking and somebody in chat is saying that what he's trying to do is create a second stream to kind of create a, a split between Ralph's audience and his. But even then, that doesn't make too much sense. I don't know. This this entire group is retarded. I'm I'm sorry that <laughs> aside, I interrupted your election stuff, but I just wanted to put it out there, quartering. I'm here now. If you wanted to do it, or you can turn it. You can tune in Sunday Funday and watch us uh, laugh at retarded shit, which you'll be included in. I'm sure at this point. <laughs> Considering you better be careful with those vor picks, or you're gonna get fucking flagged for that shit. Oh no, I'm gonna put up full nudes. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is art. It should be permissible. It's high art, so it is. they can't flag that. That's right. By the way, I'm messaging him right now too. Um... Oh yeah, oh yeah, real fast. Just uh, so when. He, I, uh, I saw he had unfollowed me, so I talked to him, and then he went, no, 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 I didn't actually unfollow you. It was a glitch probably in the system. I, I had tweeted it at him because I made a joke about him, so that's why I thought he, he, uh, he unfollowed me. So then he followed me back. He's like, yeah, sorry about that. Me tell everyone that it was a glitch in the system. So then I tweeted out, and we were okay for like like one of my shows, and then I tweeted out, oh, it's okay. Quartering just had a... A alcoholic binge and got super fucking hammered and unfollowed a bunch of people as a joke, obviously. And then he unfollowed me after. I'm like, God damn, what a pussy. Obviously, a joke, man. Calm down. But yeah, yeah. so nice. Oh, yeah, no, it's cool. We're cool, though. We're cool. We're cool. I'm not talking shit to Keemstar, calling him a pussy. <laughs> He's drunk. He is so hammered right now. I know it. He uh, is Ralph, check fuck. if that, that tweet is gone. Which it one is gone? The Keemstar the, one? The Keemstar, Keemstar one, yeah. tweet's gone. Oh well, we'll leave it on the screen even longer then. <laughs> I, I, I think it, I think he got reported, so I had to delete it. Really? No. Oh yeah. yeah. The quartering says, "Keem, you pussy, tell Jim to fire up his streamer. You can set the fuck down too. You low IQ, yeah. fake ass, energy drink pushing gnome." <laughs> okay, he really he really wants to fight that he's not actually going to put. That's kind of what he was saying to me, but I was like, he's been on air on this very program with Jim before. Matter of fact. You know, it took a couple of days to get them both on at the same time. And I was like, oh, okay. And I'm thinking, wow, this might, you know, be some sparks here. It might be, you know, might be spicy or whatever. And then they got on and courting was, I don't know, it was, it was a very sub submissive type performance. So I was like, okay, well, uh, it didn't really pan out. And now he's talking shit again. And so if, if the offers are he won't fire up his stream, okay. So Jim says you can either come on here or you can start start up the stream on your channel, which is your home turf, and make all the you know if it's about money, you make the money yourself. Like what? well, yeah, I mean you know we all know quarter pounders really hurting for the cash, Mister Seven Figures running the forty thousand dollar <laughs> fucking GoFundMe. <laughs> I'm just saying if 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 it's about somebody else making money, okay, well just go ahead and start on your own and and, and let it let it happen on your channel, but. I don't know. I'll message them. Uh, I'll see if he responds here in a minute. Um, oh, I'm sorry, man. Could can who the fuck is this? Who the fuck is the quartering? I've could, never heard of this. Well, exactly. You got it right. That's I, it's it's a a Some homosexual. Don't worry about it. I mean, I haven't been following this stuff, but I've literally never heard of this person until now, and it sounds like he has a lot of influence. And I'm just wondering why. Like, what is his qualifications? Who the fuck is he? He's fat on the internet. <laughs> that gave him qualifications. <laughs> that, that's all you need to do these days. Is he from Gamergate? Is he Gamergate alumni? I don't actually know. I'm not. I'm not no, super he wasn't around. I don't think he was. Nah, that I ever saw. 
So what? Why is he famous? Is there any reason? Oh, uh, he he's he got a boost, I think, off of Comicsgate, right? Wasn't he into that for a while? Yes. yes. Yeah. yeah not not just Comicsgate, but he had the thing with Magic the Gathering or whatever, where they're like he had a beef with them, and I guess they threw him out or whatever. <laughs> Magic I, I the know. Gathering. I was in still... jail, so I wasn't around for all this, but I heard about it later. So. But he's a part of Sargon's groups now. Have you heard of Sargon? I I have in fact heard of Sargon. Yes. I don't live oh, that much under. The, they're butt buddies, <laughs> I think. Are they? Okay, so that's how he got famous as being butt buddies with Sargon. Sargon fucked him. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, that explains it. That's all I need to know. Well, yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I'll tell him the same thing I said publicly. I mean, having it here is is not the worst thing ever. Uh, having other options, by the way, even even when we left E Love, I didn't just say, "Well, for you. And I did have a little bit of saltiness, but I wasn't like, "Oh, fuck E Love, hope they fail." It's good to have other options. So just because it's not on YouTube, it's not necessarily a a negative. Uh, it'd be good to have it here. People are gonna clip it regardless. Uh, I'm not. So I'm not banned from being shown on YouTube. I've been on other streams. Like, wait, Ralph, can, can you it, can so. you look at his latest tweet? Is he? Yeah, I can. It's that he's he calls Keemstar. He's like that kid tweeted me by the way. But then he's like, type Alex is an N in the chat. So he's going on about oh, Jim's afraid to let his stream go because people say you know shit that'll get him in trouble. But then he won't type nigger in his tweet when he's obviously that's what he's referring to. Well, well yeah, because I mean, the so time. he's a giant fucking pussy. Yeah, that's type projecting on Twitter. Decide. Is he chicken or is he uh, two patties of beef on a sesame seed bun? Because I'm getting conflicting stories now. I know it's it could be a little confusing. Um, God, these faggots are such a time sink. I swear to God. Yeah, this guy's pissing me off. It's like you could easily make this happen if you really, really wanted to come on. You have a link. Just click he it. He doesn't. They don't want to. They're passive aggressive. They argue like fucking Tumblr girls. I mean, that's that's really what it is. It's like teenage girls on the internet. You know how they get really pissy and passive aggressive with each other, but they don't want direct confrontation. That's what he is. That's that's how they are. I think this is a low blow, but like the whole flagging shit, it just reminds me of, of like fucking Anita and all those people. Like this is what they would do. They would pick fights. And then when people started talking tough, they'd report it and get their shit taken down. And that was the that was the entire thing. And now they're all they're all like subscribed to that. And it's like, I don't understand why. Just do your shit. If you really want to be the big brain intellectual on YouTube, just fucking do that and stop picking fights with people. Well, I messaged him. We'll see what he says on this last salvo. I mean, honestly, I just want to see something fun. We've had the election. The election, I mean, it's pretty much over at this point. Beyond, like, individual races, you know, that you can go through. Uh, so I thought it'd be, I thought it'd be fun. I thought it'd be a good way to promote a new platform. I know Cording maybe he thinks he's bulletproof or more on YouTube. Maybe the skeptics think they're bulletproof. If they do think that, they're retarded because uh, they're not. And so, you know, building up other places. And of course, I'm selfish. I'd like to see it on on my show, but um, I, th I don't know. I think it'd be, I think it'd be cool. I think it'd be fun. So we'll see. Oh, oh I'm looking at the house results right now. Uh, yeah, let me pull it. Maybe, yeah, maybe we should what's actually. The score? 18 seats lost. Okay. Maybe we should so pull it. So, five more. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, what, which side are you looking at? Uh, New York Times, uh, okay. to their interactive map. Okay. I'm using uh, Politico. Politico's thing is a little bit ahead of the others. Right now, they say that they have 20, uh, and they predicted 18 out of the races that are yeah, called so far. So I had the New York Times. That was the one I was looking at, 157 to 156, but it's Republicans down 18, like like they said. Um, let me look at governor. I want to see the Politico governor. just said uh, 21. Uh, they're up 21 now. Looks like Scott Walker is in trouble in... Um, it's wait. close, though. No, it's very close, actually. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to withhold that comment. Um, Florida, have they called those races yet? Uh, yep, Ron DeSantis called for the governor. Senate has not been called, but it looks like it's on its way. Uh, let's see, what else? Uh, Ted Cruz has already been called in Texas. We're missing Missouri. But that was a key state. Nevada's not going to come in for a little while, so as far as uh, Dean Heller and stuff, do we have any type of information on that at this point? Not yet. Okay. Um, let's see, Senate. Oh, God damn it. I clicked the wrong window. Senate. Yep. Wow. McCaskill down 
eight points, eight plus eight plus points with eighty three percent reporting. I'll go ahead and make that call for you, gentlemen. And ladies and gentlemen, there are a few ladies watching the stream. Uh, and here with us as well, by the way, thank you, Emily. Uh, Claire McCaskill's done in Missouri, so I'll make that call. And I'll check and see. I don't know. I just I think it'd be fun if Corey would jump on. Uh, well, he's been on the fucking show before. I've seen him live. Yeah, he's been on here plenty of times. That's the thing. Like, it's like he's actually been on here with Jim at least once, and I think maybe twice. So it's like, well, you're talking all this shit. You've been on the show this many times. Like, why not just jump back on? You know, talk shit, and then just go back and do your own thing. Like, why even? It's not. It's not even that big a deal. E even if you got blown the fuck out, it's like, okay, well, whatever. Just well, don't fucking stream me, and your friends aren't going to publish clips of it, so don't fucking worry about it. I don't know. It just it just doesn't make. <laughs> it's just whatever. He he really yeah he really wants Jim to make a competing stream. We're just waiting for that cuck Mister Anti Bully to fire up a stream any minute now. He, he's he's trying to split the audience. That's what he's fucking doing. I I don't know what he, he is can it. Wait. I, I, you know, I guess I, 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 these big brain plans just are a little beyond me. I, so I'll just I'll, I'll have to wait till Sunday, Jeremy. You can you can watch in the audience if you like. <laughs> but so, and I'll just say this again, just to give him a little bit more time if he wants to respond or jump on. Of course, I don't think he's going to. But um, so so he said you could start up your own stream, or he could come on on Sunday. But the, your options were basically. First off, you're already doing a stream. I, I'm not the one that invited. Yeah, him I'm gonna say. First off, he started. He started the whole fight in the first place, or the whole dispute, or whatever. He's the one that started talking about it, and then yeah. he said, "Hey, kiddo. Hey, buckaroo, buddy. Why don't you? Why do we have a chat, kiddo?" So it's like, okay, well, let me finish that, and then I come back, and it's like, oh, he's got to host it. <laughs> you're the one that invited me, you dumb, drunken idiot. Yeah, so you, he's calling Keemstar cut now too. This and, is this is weird. Well, you already like, been on I, here for what I don't know two or three hours tonight, and and actually you said, well, okay, if you want to host it, you can host it yourself. So like, what is the what's stopping him from starting up a stream on his own? Like I don't know. It's so weird. Like, <laughs> yeah, I I can make if I'd done an election stream tonight, I probably oh, would have made no really time. good money. Sure. But I, but I'm not going to do it for two reasons. One, I, I stream on Sundays, but the other one is you're doing an election stream. It would have felt cuntish to me when you've been spending like two weeks fucking advertising the thing. And then you get thrown off of YouTube to then go on to YouTube and do a fucking competing stream. It would be a kind of an asshole move for somebody to do to another guy that's going through a bit of shit at the moment. Yeah, by the way, I'll just say this publicly. I, and I already figured that, but I appreciate that. Uh, because yeah, obviously I know if you've done a stream, I mean it's like it's ten, twenty, thirty thousand or more people watching it. Well, I, I, you know that's speculation. Maybe you know maybe uh, Sticks would have blown me out. He had a fucking large audience tonight. I mean he like no, he did. Days, Sticks like, killed yeah. it. I'm not even like I'm not no shade at Sticks. I'm just saying if you've done, I mean it's guaranteed ten, maybe even twenty, but or thirty. Like I'm I'm just saying you would have done very well and you would have cleaned up. It, it's not even about that. Uh, but I appreciate you, you know, sticking here with us. Obviously, like you said, <laughs> we're going through some things. Like, like you said, we're going through some shit. Uh, so I, it's definitely, it definitely is appreciated. So I don't know. I, I, don't I know. put out something real quick. I've noticed on the uh, New York Times website. So they had like six different races on the Republican favored side in the House that were all like leaning Democrat and said Democrat, and they were light blue. Now there's only down to three. So. I'm not saying the Republicans are going to take the House, but it seems like this whole Democrats are going to win by 10 seat thing may have been vastly no. exaggerated. That's not going to happen. No, um, they're because they're, they're almost at their 24. But yeah, they're running out of like safe seats. And it looks California might be a, a, a bigger split than people are anticipating, because right now it's 50 50 in terms of, uh, of the House. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just I'm looking through like yeah, 51 right now for the Senate for Republicans, and then uh, the House is 162, 161. That just happened. The Senate seat for Republicans that just got called. So now we're 51 for GOP in the Senate. Oh, very good, very nice. All right. Well, Gordon's not saying anything else, so I don't know. I, th I thought you know. Well, he like... keeps fucking tweeting. I was Dude, like, where does this guy get? Oh, sorry. Go ahead. I'm just gonna say, how do you get that much of an ego? Like, what accomplishments do you have to get that ego? What are the accomplishments? YouTube, I guess. I don't fucking know. Is that what people's self worth is based off of? 
yeah in this environment yeah yeah it's shocking isn't it it's i mean YouTube. yeah i mean it's like how could he like compete with you how could he have the audacity to compete with you jim i mean that's insane I'm just wondering how he how where he got his balls i mean it's admirable in the fact that he has these balls in the first place I've never even heard of the guy. I mean, well, I'm not. Really, it's not even. It's not even competing with somebody. I mean, it's just it's gay YouTube shit, right? It's yeah. Who fucking cares? I I don't know. The, the, these people. I don't know. It makes. I feel like I have like a short circuit when I deal with fucking skeptics. I don't know what it is about them, but it's like he, you want to have a talk, if you want to have a beef or or whatever. I mean, just get on talk and and then it's over. Like I, I don't understand the whole. And I'm looking at his tweets, and actually, you know, he. Can, uh, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to be a bitch or whatever, reveal private conversations. But, uh, you know, he said this in public. Well, uh, you know, Jim's are kind of blaming him. I saw him quote tweeted Zidane and say, "Oh well, you know, try to kind of blame you for us getting banned," which is, I mean, ridiculous. First off, insane. There, you know, yeah, it's ridiculous. And you know, the the heel street was was my idea. Um, it was not anyone else's. And I did that on my own. It was my idea not to talk to the journalist. I have thought, you know, maybe if I'd talked to the journalist and I had a quote, you know, in the report saying, you know, I disavow or whatever, um, maybe they would have let me stay. But but the, the thing about it is they were probably going to kick us off regardless anyway. So I, I'm not going to sit there and spend a lot of time, you know, wringing my hands. Fuck it. Why bend, the, why bend the knee for a fucking Yeah, but I'm going to be honest. Report. I did. I did think. Maybe if I'd have talked to her and just, you know, kind of said, oh, I don't support that. Uh, never talk to the press. I, I don't. Well, I, I honestly don't think so. I don't think so, but I'm just saying there's a possibility. That thought has crossed my mind. Anyway, I'm not going to blame anybody but myself and, you know, the regime there that got us kicked off. You know what I mean? I'm not I'm not going to uh, blame. That's ridiculous to say what? Jim I'm came gonna, on the stream, but. Kicked off YouTube. Yeah. I mean, he did come on the stream. He did laugh with us, did have fun with us, but it wasn't. Wasn't his idea? It wasn't like I don't know. He's just, I, I, he's just trying know. to drive I mean, wedges I, where nothing, no, I, I, no, I've got none a exists. Maybe, maybe tell me if this makes sense to you. Go ahead. Okay. Do you think maybe he's got some slight brain damage from getting fucking sucker punched by a tranny so hard? <laughs> like the guy what's doing it? Like he got beat up by a man in a dress in public. Maybe that fucked him up so much that he's turned into this. Is that what he's famous for? Yes, he got One beat up by a tranny. Man. Yes, that is what he's famous for. He got God. beat by a fucking tranny. At oh a man, it's easy to get famous on the internet these days. <laughs> man. I mean, I did a cartoon. I uh, well, I've been animating for about 15 years and i built up a slow and steady following because of that and uh i did my one of my best is the ascent of alfred go youtube that if you haven't the ascent of alfred that's my finest work i mean that's pretty good it took a lot of hours and it takes a lot of talent and even i don't have as much e ego as this guy who you know got beat up by a tranny in public you know so yeah, he got his uh, he got his shit slapped around, and then he needed forty thousand dollars to sue them for hurting him in public, or I don't know what the what is he suing him for? It was uh, oh god, do we have the complaint? I don't know. I have to look it up. He actually one of them were like like emotional damage, like PTSD type things. Like he had, <laughs> I swear to God, I'm not even wait. He didn't like, get beat up by uh, Chris Chan, did he? I'm, I'm no. not saying that. Yeah, that would have been better. That oh, would have okay. been better. I'm not even no. saying that to like make fun. Of I'm just being honest. Like that is actually what the complaint says. Uh, hold on, I'll, I'll pull it up. But yeah, go ahead, Zidane. I was gonna. Yeah, the thing that irks me about that is, I remember when him and fucking CRP were bitching about their bank accounts for like 40 minutes and just having a money fight on one of the postmortems, the early ones. And now he has to like go fund me a lawsuit. First of all, it's not going to go anywhere. Like you're claiming PTSD or something. What the fuck? I didn't hear about that. Like come the fuck on. Yeah, dude. here we go. The claim as read by Riketa, Nick Riketa, regular kill stream guest. By the way, we got to get Nick Riketa over here on, on uh, stream.me. But anyway, um, so Nick Riketa says indicates that Loter, that's the guy he's accusing of these things. Uh, did in fact assault Hamley and the defendant admitted to it via a Facebook post where he used the language hashtag punch Nazis after the alleged assault took place. Uh, blah, 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 blah. The claim goes on to detail the multiple injuries allegedly suffered by Hamley. By the way, Hamley is the quartering, uh, to be clear. And it's not a dox. I mean, it's out there. 
Uh, those injuries include burst blood vessels, head lumps, cuts on his arms, multiple bruises, and emotional and physical trauma preventing him from attending substantial portions of Gen Con 2018, meeting schedule with vendors and other obligations at Gen Con 2018, and creating Gen Con 2018-related content, which would have resulted in substantial revenue for Hamley. Hamley's claim indicates that Loader allegedly attacked him before Gen Con 2018 started in order to maximize financial injury. As far as the emotional injury Hamley exhibits, the claim indicates he suffers from anxiety, stress, panic attacks, and depressions. <laughs> so a 400, ma- 400 pound man got beat up by a tranny. Yes. He got, he got his shit slapped around by a tranny at a comic book convention. And it fucked him up so much he needs psychotherapy. You don't get PTSD from one event. That takes multiple events over a long period of time to get PTSD. Well, look, so the Monday Matt stream, which is probably, even though it wasn't our like highest rated stream, whatever the fuck you want to call it, like it got the most like attention and it has the most long lasting impact. So I went on InfoWars and the motherfucking host on InfoWars knew about Monday Matt. He's sitting there <laughs> laughing. You saw that Jim like he's laughing about it. He's like, yeah, I saw that. <laughs> like, like he knew all about it. It's just insane. And so on the Monday Matt stream, Cording was there. And later on in that stream, after, you know, shit had died down and we were just, I don't know what we were doing. I guess I was wasted and we just kept talking. It was me and Keemstar. Post, and- someone said in the chat, PTSD, post tranny slap fight depression. <laughs> <laughs> but it was me and Keemstar and I think James also was still there. I don't remember, but we were all talking. Oh, and- I think I think he's, he, I think he agreed. Somebody said, why not now? Why Sunday? Why Jim's channel? You want in or you want to get in now? And he said, cool with me if Jim is there. Is he that, just tweeted that out. You've been here. I told him you were here. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh right, go, go look at his newest uh, tweet. And reply, I see right? it. I see okay. it. So that's him agreeing, right? I mean, that's that's what it looks like to me. Yeah. So if he doesn't show up now, his dumb, drunken, retarded ass is really a giant walking vagina. So here we go. Why not now? Yeah, I'll repeat it just like you did. Uh, Saint Foggy says, "Why not now? Why Sunday? Why Jim's channel? You want it? Get it now." The recording says, cool with me if that AARP child Jim is in. Well, I mean, <laughs> you're here right now. Okay, good. Um, he agreed. Well, let's let's wait for the big boy himself to show up. All right, let's, let's Emphasis do Emphasis on big. But but anyway, it, later on towards this, you know, the I guess it's the last hour or two in the stream. Is me. By the way, I'm going to send the link and copy-paste this, his own tweet. Um, But uh, later on towards in the stream... You know, we were talking about the issue. By the way, you know, I don't. If somebody comes up and sucker punches you, I mean, I understand, you know, being mad about it or whatever. But I told him flat out, I was, I was just like, well, you know, if it was me personally, I, you know, I've been in fights, I've had things happen. You know, I didn't like how they turned out. As far as starting, you know, lawsuit crusades and stuff like that, I would personally just let, you know, whatever, just move on, talk shit about the person or whatever you want to do, just move on. As far as investing months worth of your life keemstar said this thing same thing to him by the way and that's why he's mad at keemstar like i i you know we both said the same it's like it's like whatever dude some guys you know punched you or whatever just move on like as far yeah, as move so, on all right yo yeah. guys i uh it's almost midnight here yeah, i have to get good. going man but like it was really great Emily, being on here yeah. thank you very much hopefully you come back and hopefully i would love uh, to come back i've been thinking about hitting you guys up and asking you guys to have me back we definitely I miss will. you guys. Uh, I'm oh, sorry for fucking too. it up. I know you guys are doing election coverage. I didn't... No, no, that's okay. Just, but... It's okay. No, it doesn't it's matter. Just, yeah, it doesn't yeah. matter. I just want to say, well, this is a really great platform. I'm really happy to hear this exists. I'm probably going to start animation streams on here because I've been Please do. And by the way, hit me up on that because we're talking to, the, like, we have, you know, we have the ear of the people, like, running this place. So just, oh, just yeah? let me know. Not not that we don't have, like, a percentage share profit or anything in the company, but I'm just saying if, if there's anything you want to know about the platform or you have a username you want and somebody else has and stuff like that uh, oh we, yeah we, absolutely we i'm yeah, sure yeah. somebody already has you know but i know you guys can get it for me so yes. it's great. if you want that yeah we'll get it for you thank you emily oh wow it. yeah <laughs> well, um, <laughs> Powers, screw your optics i'm going in and, oh god uh, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Later, Emily. Thank you for joining us. We have been Thank blessed. you, guys. I'll talk to you soon, all right? Thank yes, you very much. Good. All right. Our first Bye. And la- Thank you. Our first and last broadcast here on... Uh- <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, I did see that. My wife is showing me the Keemstar tweet. I did. We did. We had that up. Somebody said he deleted that. That's still up though, right? So she just, it's still up. No, it's not. You had it pulled up before? Yeah. And okay. I think he had to delete it because he got reported. Oh, oh fucking course. Yeah. Oh, what? Go check his timeline and see if it. Uh. That's just what I think happened because I don't think he would delete it himself. I, I, I don't know. Can somebody explain to me? It's been five minutes now. And I mean, he said he's coming on. Where is he? Yeah, so I don't know if he's like he seems to be discombobulated. He wants so <laughs> I don't know what he said publicly. It seemed to be like, well, let's just do it now, and then uh, um, no, not seem to be. That's pretty conclusive. I thought it was okay. fairly yeah, conclusive. Yeah, yeah, I did. I mean, I'm it, it's it's flat out there. Maybe, maybe fat idiots shouldn't let liquor talk. So to them. he's going talk. into this thing. I don't know. I, I don't. I don't. So, you know, I come into Welsh. I share every single thing he's saying, but I guess yeah, it's it's one of the talking points that I hear. Like, well, you know, Jim doesn't care about you. Doesn't care about these people. He just, he just, you know, destroys and you know, like, are, are we living on the same fucking planet? These faggots have been out to basically screw with you, screw yes. with Horsky, even screw sure. with Tonka back in the day. They're the ones that were going around saying shit like, this is so violent, this is so racist, this inspires such terrible things. And then they're going to turn around and say, I'm the bad guy because what, I say I'm not your bestest friends and that we don't hang out in Skype chats? Because we don't. Yeah, so I'm saying, like, <laughs> like the only time I ever talked to you is here on the air. I think we traded a few messages here and there. Ain't no back in the day, whatever, we had some conversation. But, like, it's not, we're not, I mean, it's just being honest, we don't talk about oh what you know what have, have what, these people benefited any of you guys ever have they ever no, gone not really. you ever no you got fucked off a platform i didn't see them doing shit about it except for doing cartwheels and talking shit when andy got fucked with when he had his uh breakdown when he had his fucking breaks they did they were laughing about it when you got fucked with they were laughing about it when tonka initially got fucked with they were laughing about it they don't want it, it's just they want to have some little click on YouTube that that runs that corner, I guess. I don't know. It's like high school shit. It's really fucking bizarre. Yeah, so, um, you know, I linked him the stuff, and he said, you know, he said again, Jim's channel, and he's talking about you retards think he cares about you or whatever. Look, oh, I, okay, I don't, okay. he, he said my point was that he's hiding his live streams behind lies of being DDoSed. He understands that I streamed after I got it fixed, right? Like, I explained to people the night I got DDoSed, hey, I'm getting fucked with. It took me a few days to fix that. And then I fucking streamed after that. Like, he knows that, right? Or is he retarded? I don't know. Look, I judge people by how they like treat me and, and their actions. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't have delusions like, like, like you've said, and I've said this publicly, me and you've talked about this on air. It's not like we're, we're, we're not friends. It's not, it's not being some coy thing. Like we don't talk off the air. We don't, you know, chop it up and have, you know, t our wives don't have tea. You know what I mean? Like, like it's not, it's not some relationship like that. It's, it's not the thing. Like I, I do like you and, and I've, you know, talked to you, you know, many times over the years. Uh, but it's not that situation, and that's not a bad thing. Like, it's not, I don't know. It's just the whole, oh, he doesn't care. Well, look, like like we talked about earlier, you could have ran a stream tonight on YouTube and made many thousands of dollars, and you would have deserved all every single dollar. Um, but yet, you know, you're here on this stream. You spent hours and hours on this show. You promoted us every, you know, step of the way. Like it's, I just want a fucking show that's entertaining that I can yeah, watch. Yeah, exactly. Like, how, like is I, that, how is that hard for people so, to get? So how can somebody sit here and say, "Oh, he doesn't care about you. He's just retarded." Well, look, I don't know. I I just know what I see, and this guy who is very popular on his own and could do anything he wants pretty much on his own is sitting here and he spent I don't know what four or five hours on this show at this point has promoted us even when when we was on D Live, which is retarded uh, pretty much a retarded site um but we still you know you were promoted us and it did great um you support us at every single turn so like I, I don't understand the trying to turn me or you against me like it's just it just doesn't bear out in the facts you know what i mean like anybody can see it's just not true so well, I mean, it, it reeks of the uh, the capos doing their capo thing, right? Like, what do they do? They always try to 
play people against each other, get yeah. people to fight and with each other. And it's not even because we're like. friends. Like Jim said, it's because, like, well, I just want an entertaining show. It's not because, you know, we, we have some, you know, deep, oh, my God, friendship. No, it's just because, like, we, you know, we like talking to Jim. He likes the show. It's not, it's, it's no deeper than that. And uh, I don't know. I just... I just think, and I told him this, and I'll say the same uh, thing boy, publicly. It, it's it's done. The blue wave is real. They had twenty three seats. Oh, they did. Okay. Yep. Well, they're projected horrible. to they're projected at two thirty. I don't know. I, I'll say just to finish this up. I'll say the same thing publicly that I said to him. Um, like I just I and I told him this. I was like, well, just come on. I mean, I think it'll be funny. I think it'll be entertaining. Like, there's really. Like, I don't really understand a reason why you wouldn't want to come on after you said all this shit publicly. Like, just just come on and have, you know, talk your shit, have fun. Like, it's not the end of the world. Like, why is this? Why are you trying to turn into, oh, he needs to come on his his channel or whatever. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense to me. Am I, am I like, having diarrhea in the mouth here or does anybody else? Like, now I don't know. Now he's, now he's caps locking and talking shit to people. Or... <laughs> He's like, oh no, don't unsubscribe, random internet person. Like, <laughs> this is a good drunk rant, Jeremy. This is going to end well for you when you start to go down this road uh, with your audience. It always works out really well when you start showing out or you know shitting stuff like that out. Yeah, I don't know. I just and and we've seen that argument before. Who who else was it? Uh, God, who said that the other day? I can't remember. Um, I saw it on your Twitter, and I saw it before. Like, oh, what the fuck? Jim abandoned Ralph and he's not coming on a show. When you were actually on our very first, you know, show post YouTube and, and promoted us. And I don't know. And even if you weren't, like, just you didn't denounce us or anything. Like, I, I don't know. I just don't understand this whole. They're desperate to create, you know, fissures well, where they don't exist. It's a lot of wishful thinking. Like, they, they really want it to be the case. And so they just keep saying it, thinking that. The more they say it, the more it's going to happen. I mean, this is how Sargon and his capos well, see, What they don't understand is there is almost no communication between me and Jim ever. Like, there is, oh, will you come on this show? Like, it's usually when we're on the show at the same time. Oh, uh, that's how he got on the lecture show. I was like, you know, you mind coming on? You know, you, you free? Yeah, I'll come on. It, it wasn't, oh, a long, you know, meeting or something, some long conversation we had. Like, that's just not... This is not the case. <laughs> like, it's retarded. You know what I mean? Like this doesn't happen. Maybe that's how they work, but that's not how most people. It's work. this. It's this fucking Discord mindset. All you guys yeah. have of talking to each other on that fucking. Oh, like, I don't. I don't touch Discord. <laughs> I don't talk to anybody. That's the beauty of not using Discord. Yeah, I was just like, oh, you know, are you free? You think you come on our election stream? I think you know some people like to see it. Like it wasn't wasn't oh a, a big plot. I just I don't know. It's just stupid to me uh, how they think um i don't know anyway i think that's part of their problem is they don't think most of these people like they only watch jim when he's shit talking them they haven't seen when jim's gone on streams just because they entertain him it doesn't matter if there's Dude, like a i've seen there, jim so and i know he's here i don't want to talk about him like he's not here but i've seen him go on streams with you know, 10 20 30 40 people like it's not like he won't go on shows like it's just i don't know it's just because if they're salty, yeah. Well, I mean, Ralph, he's, he's saying about. it's he's saying it's hard to like you, and uh, your fans are retards. <laughs> well, I mean, look, it's you know I've now tried. Are you, now are you uh, Jim, gonna, you know me. No, no, Ralph, are you going to take that and be like, "Well, Carter, he's an okay guy." We no, you know me. Him. Look, you know me, right? I am very like. It would be easy to just absolutely shit on Donga. It would be easy, and I have shit on him a little bit, and I've called him out. It'd be easy to, you know, call Cording a faggot, you know, fucker that well, got beat up, up by training. Hold, hold those thoughts. Have a few more drinks. Let's see if we can get you to do it tonight. No, but you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I, I actually kind of hold fire. Like, I'm just, it, it, you know, I know I have the reputation. I'm just, just drunk Ralph, get on there and say anything. But I'm actually very, you know, like, okay, well, this person does this, he yeah, says I, that. I, yeah. That's like what I said, diplomatic. Yeah, I am because you know sometimes even V. So V's, you know, he's retarded a lot of the times. But he did. You know, <laughs> no, I mean, let's be honest, he's retarded. <laughs> he's retarded. But he put out a video defending us, and you know, I was just like, okay, that was nice to see. Now, the the truly skeptic, the truly cynical, would look at that and say, well, V's full of shit, and he's just putting that out to try to you know co-opt people. 
uh, and to try to, you know, gain favor where he really shouldn't have any. Um, but I, I do try to, I don't know, I try to take people, you know, as at an individual level. And so even courting, he's been on this show many times. He actually donated to the show. Um, that's why I don't understand. It's like, okay, you have a, you, you know, you have some conversation to have with Jim. Well, he's right here right now. You've been on this show at least 10 times. You've been on this show with Jim. So just get on. Like, what are you, like, what are you trying to force here? Like, that's not going to happen. You're not going to, you know, make somebody do something like it's, I don't know. Uh, but as far as, you know, I, and I hate that. That's that's why I got into an argument with, with, with uh, what's his name, Devin Tracy. Oh, but your audience is this and that. I don't know. I don't like hearing that. Um, as, as, because I feel like people use this whole audience thing as like a, a, a way to attack you without saying it. Like, oh, well, your audience is doing this and that. Or, oh, they spam posted swastikas in the chat. Oy vey. Like, okay, so what? Like, well, you... here's what it boils down to. It boils down to that they don't have the audience that we do, and they think they can trick you into disavowing your audience as a way to kill off your momentum. Well, a That's lot of these people are scared. A lot, of, Jader, a, a lot of these people are scared, and they see what's happening, and they say, oh, God, like, this guy just got banned. He, you know, he had a you know, great show go on, uh, at least a popular show, whether you think it was great or not. Um, and he got just completely kicked off YouTube. You know, maybe maybe I need to watch my shit. Uh, I I do think a lot of it is that, and that they're they're afraid. Which I mean, you know, that happens. But are you saying they're trying to virtue signal against you because they're hoping that oh, well, if I say something bad about Ralph, maybe Susan won't uh, won't take my shit and tell me to fuck off. Uh, I, again, I just like to to highlight this because he's trying to like you know rewrite history here, and it's really obvious when you go look at his timeline that's not what happened. So maybe when he sobers up and he listens to clips from this, he'll understand why it looks like a fucking buffoon. Uh, but quartering, uh, you say he's again from Jump Street. I said uh, uh, your dad Jim to stream. No, you invited me to chat. You said uh, how about we have a chat, kiddo? That's that's you asking me to come on to your stream. That's that's pretty obvious. It's in your timeline. So, you know, actually, when I read it, I thought courting was lob. So like I did, I wasn't, you know, we were talking about the election. I didn't even know what was going on. So, you know, I saw a chat, you know, they started going off about it. I was like, oh, courting must have a stream going on. So I turned it to his channel and there was nothing going on. So I was like, oh, OK, well, what's what's happening? And then, you know, I went, you know, it seems like he's trying to make you start a stream. But what I originally thought was, oh, courting must have a stream going on right now. What What's what's happening and then I turned on to his channel and there was nothing happening. So, it, uh, he, Yeah, I, I, again, he, he's welcome to show up here or he can watch my stream on Sunday when I do it. Yeah, I sent, I sent him a last uh, last dish message. Uh, I don't have a lot of faith that he's going to show up. Though, I have honest. no faith in him. I, yeah. I have no faith in his Reddit-like ass, no. I, I, I told him that, you know, I think it was the morning kumite. Uh, where I told him he was a Reddit faggot, and he didn't like that very much. And it's been, I guess there's no love loss from that point forward. But just honestly, just from a, you know, a brainwave standpoint, like, what is the worst that could happen for him? Like, okay, just come on. You're the one that started up. Just come on. and uh, He's the one that he keeps talking about principles, and I, I don't know yeah. what he wants to talk about. I have no idea what the fuck he's going on about, to be honest. I don't I don't either. It's like, well, okay, you, you have a problem, or you have some conversation you want to have. Okay, well, just just have it. And then I I don't know. I just don't. I, I guess I'm just missing the boat. Uh, Andy, are you still here? <laughs> He's Andy, left. Andy, he said he had to, yeah, he said he had to go AFK for a little bit. Okay, I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something, but I just don't like. I don't know. You you wanted the talk, have the talk, and it's not like your the the fan base or whatever the fuck you want to call. It. I don't like the word fan. Um, the viewer base. Just, just the word fan makes me like, uh, I just don't like it. Um, it doesn't really overlap that much. Just have, have your conversation and you know. now he's tweeting out his social blade numbers. Oh God. Oh, okay. Uh, he's been, me and him have been going out in DMs actually. Well then why uh, is he tweeting them at me? I'm not the one in DMs. <laughs> yeah. Cause I, tw I tweeted out the poll that we did and I said, uh, there's more people who vote in this poll than you have in a week's worth of streams. Yeah, so he just said he's not he's not just 
as a funnel. He's not going to do it unless it's oh, on so your So after channel. he agreed to it and tweeted out that he would come on, he's yeah. not going to do it. Okay, so we're said. clear on that. After he said, I will come on, he is not yes. going to come on. Okay, He's good. not going to come on unless it's on your channel. That's what he told me anyway. God, I, I'm sorry. I'm not the one that invited him. He invited me. I never made any promises to fucking platform him. I've got a stream on Sunday quartering. You can watch it with everybody else if you want. If you want to talk tonight, you're more than welcome to pop on here. Or start your own stream, right? You said that yeah, too, right? Or, if, or if you want, yeah. yeah. If you want to start your own stream, by the way, I know he's listening. Um, if you want to start your own stream, that's fine. If you don't want to, you think you're giving us money or whatever or attention, just go ahead and start your own stream because I would very much like to watch it. And I'm not even gonna restream it because I'm probably gonna be like asleep or or at least signed off. Asked so out. yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be. I have some chicken chicken wings in there that I'm gonna be eating. Uh, but yeah, I would like to see it. So if you want to start on your own, I think that would be a good option. But... You think, I, maybe he doesn't realize he's coming off like an ass. Maybe he thinks he's winning this, but well, like he, everything he's throwing out makes him look stupid. Well, it'd be one thing if, if you were the one like fucking with him or whatever, but that's, that's not the case again. Well, no, I mean, I, I've said this before and I, I tweeted it out before and I, I've made this statement before this group of people, like they're, they're imitators. They're not innovators. They'll latch onto something or use an insult. They hear other people use, right? Because they can't think for themselves. So like, he's trying, I guess, with the social blade numbers. He thinks that's going to affect me. I, I talk shit about numbers to Sargon because I know that does fuck with them. Yes. You could be making 50,000 subs a day. It doesn't make a difference to me, quartering. You could be pulling in millions of views a day. It doesn't make a difference to me. It, it right. has no effect. You're trying to imitate. Why don't you innovate and come up with an insult that hasn't been bandied about at you for the last year and a half? Like the cuck shit or the NPC stuff. Or the uh, ego stuff or the number stuff. Come up with something original. Can you do that? Can you be original? Is that something that it's in your programming? Well, I've seen you be, you know, complimentary of, of people who are blown up. Like it's it's not it's not a jealousy thing. And I've also seen you on, you know, especially some of the old metacasts, you know, talk to anybody. It's not I don't know. I, I just I don't want to well, do, yeah. I, I don't want to defend you too much. We were like, Well, Ralph, you know, he's totally in the yeah, back you, for Jim. That dick, Ralph. No, yeah. uh, <laughs> No, no, but I talked about, yeah, CRP, his fucking channel's exploding. Yeah. Like, that guy's fucking pulling in retardedly large amounts of numbers. Like, he, he's tapped into a market. His channel's fucking exploding. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think he's going to come on. I'll check one more time. Of course he's not. Uh, he's he. This is just, he's doing the passive-aggressive shit. He'll still drop in the morning. I think, I think he's very drunk, yes. Even more drunk than I am right now, so... Um, anyway, I want to thank you for coming on and, and helping us, uh, by the way, and promoting the new channel oh, and stuff. So, uh, you know, I, again, sorry to fuck with your election night results. Nah, but, you uh, didn't. I mean, the election shit was pretty much over. We'll go through it here in a minute and just go through a final rundown of what we know at this point. But I mean, it's pretty much over. At this well, point. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna oh, go. Ryan. Oh, fucked yeah. it up worse than you. <laughs> than yes. uh, yeah. No, I, I'm gonna go cry now because the blue wave <laughs> happened, and now I've got. <laughs> on the mocking tweets that I put out about it. So, <laughs> oh, that'll be fun as all the leftists uh, get to, you know, kick sand in my face. That'll be a good time. Thank you, Jim. We'll see you again soon. Thank uh, you. Yeah, you guys uh, have a good rest of your stream. You too. Later, Jim.